Hi everyone, welcome to the instructional video. I'm Noshin from UCB Biosciences. We are the leading suppliers of the drug testing products since 2004. We have these U cups that we are going to be showing today. This particular one is a 12 panel cup with adulterants, with three adulterants in it. These cups are FDA approved and clear waved. And they come in up to uh, 16 clear wave drug configurations. So if you look at the product, it is really nicely sealed. It's an aluminum pouch. In the front here, you have the safety and storage conditions. Right here, there is a keep away from sunlight. You have to keep the storage conditions at room temperature. So it's pretty robust product. Go from 2 degrees centigrade to 30 degrees centigrade. Um, supposed to be dry and they are not supposed to be reused there are instructions in the back of the cup that I'm going to show you stepwise these are really easy to follow and after the test is done these are the results indications that you can read negative positive and invalid so this particular uh, drug test is a 12 panel cup the 12 panels include all clear wave drugs there is amphetamine, barbiturates, buprenorphine, benzodiazepine, cocaine, methamphetamine, MDMA or ecstasy, methadone, morphine, oxycotton, PCP, pencyclidine, and marijuana, THC. What you should also note that there is a lot number right here and expiration date. So if there is any problem with the drug test device, you can call us and let us know what the problem is. Again, the drug tests are completely customizable. We have OEM services and private label options available. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to peel the aluminum pouch. And I'm going to take the product out. There is a drying agent up here to keep it in good quality for a long period of time. Right here, you have this cup, which is really beautifully designed. It's a leak-proof mechanism, so if you notice here, there is a lock mechanism here that the, um, the lid is really nicely secured. And also, there is a O-ring up here to make sure that it is a leak-proof or sure seal. So the urine sample is transported after the presumptive test is done and if it's positive to the lab for confirmation testing and they do not leak. What you also have is a peel off label right here that you can peel it off and read the results when they are ready. There are instructions to read the results which I'm going to go over after um, I show the test. Also, in the back of the cup, there is a LCD um, temperature strip to make sure that the uh, urine temperature is within the range of a biological urine, so you can tell if the urine is biological or it is synthetic, which is very common these days. So what I, we are going to do now, we are going to open the lid. This is the sample that I have prepared. It's a colored water sample just for the instructions. We are going to add this sample to the 30 milliliter mark. So if you can see right here, there is a 30 milliliter mark. I'm going to add just enough sample in here. And close the lid all the way. Seal it. You need to keep the test cup straight up and wait 10 seconds. So after 10 seconds, um, you can peel off the label and results are ready to be read in two to four minutes. So it's a very rapid result, a test that goes really fast in case of negative drug panels. If it is positive, then you're supposed to wait up to four minutes to call a results, result positive. Right here, you have a 
three adult friends on this particular cup. That's a specific gravity to make sure that the, um, the urine has normal range of a specific gravity. And you have creatinine, which is a, um, a pro amino acid that comes from a muscular protein um, to be able to tell what the levels are in, um, in normal urine. And the pH to make sure there is no adulteration due to oxidants or any other um, products that are available to adulterate unit sample. So I can see here in the test line window, you have a negative where you have two lines, a test line and a control line. So if both of the control and test lines are present, the result is negative. If there is only one line, which is a control line, and no test line, the result is positive. If you do not see any line, there is a blank window that is an invalid result. So because we used um, colored water, all of the tests are negative. You can see all the lines and it's pretty fast and clear dark lines that you can see. So the test is done. If in case there is a chance that the test is positive, then this is a presumptive test. So you're supposed to um, send it off to a confirmation lab for confirmation testing. And that is a um, instructional video for a 12 panel cup with three adult trends in it. Thank you for watching our video. And if you have any questions, uh, please check out our website at www.ucpbiosciences.com. Um, we would love to hear from you and see if we can help you in any of the products.